Hello everyone, uh, welcome back. Uh, I just uh, wanted to share a quick uh, little uh, productivity tip uh, which I uh, discovered in uh, this online service called uh, Readwise. So if you're not familiar with uh, what uh, Readwise is, uh, it is a service uh, that lets you uh, sync uh, or collect uh, all the highlights from your Kindle, Insta paper, PDFs, uh, so everything in one central location and it's also neat because it uh, sends you an email every day um, regarding the highlights you gather from different sources uh, so that it helps you uh, recover or retain uh, most of the knowledge which uh, you've been uh, acquiring on a daily basis. Again, um, I will do more videos on Readwise uh, if you're interested. Uh, but this one um, is something I was looking for a long time and it's pretty neat. And I'm so excited to share, with, share it with you. Okay. Um, so again, um, just uh, they have a free trial. So just uh, sign up if you're interested. Uh, I already did and uh, let me sign in and I'll show you uh, different um, uh, parts of this site. Um, so uh, this is uh, the daily site. Uh, this is where um, you, your notes will be there. Uh, but I had highlights. Uh, this is the one I was talking about. So you can sync it from um, a Kindle, uh, Insta paper, iBooks, uh, Medium. Uh, my clippings so anywhere uh, I mean any of these services uh, you can uh, if you have highlights or notes uh, you can automatically uh, import it into readwise again you don't have to do anything manual uh, there is plugins available so that it, it, it does it automatically for you uh, the one thing uh, we're going to be looking today uh, is the PDF import uh, it, it says it's in a beta so I guess um, a lot of improvements uh, will be made uh, but I think uh, I'm quite happy with uh, its current form and I'm sure uh, it'll also help you with uh, a lot of things you're doing. Uh, so in my line of work, um, I do have to review a lot of PDF um, uh, articles, white papers. And um, so the, the thing is, if you uh, keep on reading a lot of white papers, um, unless you make it a point to take notes right then and there, uh, it, it is so hard to keep um, up or retain uh, whatever you, you learn from it, right? Um, so this is a great way for me to just highlight it and uh, have those important points which I want to uh, keep it uh, in my long-term memory um, so that uh, so I can constantly review it and use it for my other um, uh, research papers. So anyway, uh, so let's uh, click on it and see what it says. So it says... Um, to save PDF highlights to Readwise, email the PDF to add at readwise.io. Or you can also upload the file here, right? Again, I have an account. Um, so let's try to find uh, some PDF um, files for us to use here. So I already searched a PDF, uh, getting things done. I think this is, um, if you haven't read this uh, book, uh, this is a pretty good book. So let me download it. So it works with um, a free, um, like Fox Reader, PDF Reader, or if you have Adobe, that's uh, that's good. I think it works with uh, both those uh, PDF readers. So this, okay, so now uh, you have the PDF uh, to play with. Um, so let's say uh, you, you, you're you reading this through this article and you think this quote is uh, pretty good and, and you want to save it. So let's uh, select this and uh, you can just um, highlight highlight the text okay uh, again uh, you read through the article again uh, there is no way anyone can um, remember everything that you learn but I'm sure there's a lot of points uh, which um, you would like to uh, review on a constant basis and you want to save it for um, uh, to review later uh, so let's say you you like this line for some reason and I'm going to highlight this for you uh, let's see what else we got. Uh, okay, so contents. So let's uh, go to chapter. So anyway, let's see. Um, I mean, again, I'm just doing a random uh, picks here um, just to illustrate the point. And let's just do this, for example. Okay, so now we have four. And I'm just going to go ahead and save this file um, as another um, name, just a temporary file. Uh, let's put it in desktop here. So I'm going to say Raj um, Productivity and save it here. 
So once you have the, the PDF uh, which has all the uh, saved um, highlights, all you have to do is um, go to Readwise, forgot the email. So you need to email or you can do a couple of things, right? So you don't have to. So I'm going to find the file which we downloaded here, which is in in my desktop and I'm just going to drag and drop it here. So um, it is going to be processed in the back end and um, it doesn't take too long. Uh, I think it is already done. So if you click on it here, you see the four points is right here. Uh, and also the one of the nice features about Readwise, um, it does uh, email these uh, to you on a regular basis. It just randomizes it and uh, it emails these uh, uh, highlights to you uh, on a periodic basis uh, so that you can um, keep, uh, again, uh, long-term memory is the best way to go. And uh, I think it helps you uh, for um, a lot of different um, review process, doing exams, uh, or if, even if you're doing a presentation, uh, if you're trying to memorize a script, uh, this is something uh, you can do and you make use of um, this feature within Readwise. Again, I love Readwise, uh, it's a great tool and um, they have a free 30 days uh, version uh, again i have 30, 24 days left in my free trial and um, uh, i think i'm going to um, buy a one-year plan and stick with this right um, so if you'd like to know more about readwise uh, please let me know i will create uh, more um, or other features and uh, uh, what other productivity things you can do within a readwise okay uh, thank you for your time and uh, i'll see you next time